you have already seen how to create the alias and now the time has come where you want to apply those aliases into your firewall rules so how we can use that i will be simply going into firewall so i will be going into rules i will go to wireless lan and in wireless lan i will create a new rule now which will uh, for example block the internet access to specific aliases or so i what i'll do i will click on plus here the block rule we will create for example a block rule here and that rule will be on the wireless lan interface uh, direction is in which means that coming into firewall and then the protocol will be any source here will be now amjad devices this is the alias that we created so we don't need to mention the ip address and so on so if you create this way if you create the firewall rules and tomorrow if you change the ip addresses in those particular sources so you won't need to make the changes into firewall rules because only the ips will be changed so source is here destination will be any destination port will be any i will simply save this now now this rule is created if you see here the source is the amjad devices and it, if you hover over it it will show you the ip addresses of those devices as well so i can simply now move this rule to top so i will click this and i will bring this rule on top which means that the firewall will first of all check this rule and then will apply other rules so here firewall will block everything and then it will move to next now as my ip address is 172.16.1.12 of course i should be now not able to access the outside world if i ping google.com because the rule is now active you will see here that though the dns is there but request is timeout and if i try to again access the website i won't be able to now for, uh, these are of course caching so i will just open the website again try to access syncrix.com so why it is not working because we have now applied the firewall rule to the aliases here so this is the benefit here of creating the aliases you will not need to apply the ip addresses one by one if i just open this again and if i open now the aliases so we created the source as kids devices as well so i will block the access to kids devices for example and i will save this now you can see here that these kids devices will not have any internet access and what is the range of those kids devices it is 170.16.1.50 to 170.16.1.59 so here now the internet is blocked to these kids devices based on the aliases which we applied but if we want to apply for a specific time for example at night time i want to block the access so how we'll do that let us continue to the next video where we will see how to create the schedule and we will then see how to apply that schedule to the firewall rule. Let us continue to the next video now.